morning, folks. Welcome back. $170 a ton carbon tax. $170 a ton carbon tax. Totally, absolutely ridiculous. Absolutely, totally ridiculous. I'm looking this morning at Halifax Herald on page A5. And I have here, under Premier Steve McNeil, we had what to call a response to the federal government's requirements. Nova Scotia launched a cap and trade program on January 1st, 2019. That had a four year, four years on it. And now on this year, on January 1st, 2023, which is just more than four months away, that will expire. Now, the federal government has a cap and trade program initially set at $20 a ton and increased by $10 a ton and for the first four years to $50. Now, under the federal government's updated carbon pricing benchmark, the price per ton of greenhouse gas emissions will increase by $15 each year till it reaches one, an incredible, an incredible $170 per ton by 2030. I repeat, under the federal government's updated carbon pricing benchmark, the price per ton of greenhouse gas emissions will increase by $15 each year till the, by 2030, which is only six and years and a few months away, seven years and a few months away from that now, because we're almost at 2023, seven years and four months away, less than seven and a half years, be at an incredible $170 per ton. Crazy! Nuts! Ridiculous! And this here is what you got when you got these commies. Fidel Castro's boy, and notice he cut his hair short now, Fidel's boy, Trudeau stepson, and Margaret's child, okay, and a complete, utter hypocrite. Right now, Nova Scotia is facing, come spring or late winter, 14 cents more per liter on your gasoline. So you're, at, at, you're looking at uh, 14 times 4, 56 cents a gallon for a U.S. gallon. Canadian, old Canadian gallon would be about uh, 57, 58 cents a gallon more. Just for the fucking carbon tax, I'll have to say. Just for fucking carbon tax. Let's, let's call it what it is. It's totally ridiculous. You got Germany. I got those greens over there. Greens. Didn't like nuclear? Tough. They're opening up additional coal-fired power plants to this place. The stuff they're getting, the electricity they're not getting from uh, Russian gas, the Russian natural gas and for electricity from the nuclear plants, been, plants which they've been shutting down. So anyway, back to the carbon tax. China! Communist China! All the pollution those people make! Unbelievable! Unbelievable! Remember, Justin Trudeau, he was asked one time at a forum town hall, what do you admire? I admire communist China for the ability to get stuff done. He's buddy buddy with that guy over there, Prime Minister President of the, the Netherlands, Holland, over don't want to let farmers spread manure because there's nitrogen in it. And he's buddy buddy, close, close. It's going to be around Newfoundland next week, folks. Uh, with the Omla, the greeny guy, the present Chancellor of Germany. So again, folks, you're looking at, under the federal government's policy, a next uh, increase by $15 a ton up through 2030 to an incredible $170 a ton. It's ridiculous. Wrong. Share this video far and wide and call your member of parliament. And it doesn't matter if they're conservative, NDP, black, liberal so-called, independent, whatever. Call them up. Tell them this is a, it's effing nuts. It's wrong. $170 a ton carbon tax. Wrong. No good. Bad stuff. That's the say the least. With that, I wish you a pleasant morning. All the best. God bless. Thank you very much. Bye for now. Remember,
call your member of parliament. Give them a piece of your ear and mind. Give their ear a piece of your mind. Thank you. Bye for now.